Tonight I respond to some of your questions on Facebook. Remember, if you have a question, something we can talk about, bring it up on Facebook or Twitter. Ellie on Twitter asks, any more novels on the way? The inventor was great and I'd love to read anything with such a unique writing style. Well, thank you very much, Ellie. Uh, I don't know whether there are any. I've written some more, but whether I'm going to release them or not, I don't know. It's awful hard to sell books and uh, it's easier to write them than it is to sell them. So we'll see. I've got some more written and uh, if I'm still around in six months, maybe we'll put them out. Mark on Facebook asks, what news story have you covered that kept you worrying at night? Ooh, I guess, <laughs> wow, that's a good question. Uh, I can't think of anything off the top of my head. I think that, that any news story that, that uh, just hits you in the gut, something awful, you think about it all night. It's, it, worry suggests maybe you do something about it. I can't remember covering a news story I could do anything about. But a lot of them, uh, they just, they work on you. And uh, over the 40-some years I've been doing this, there have been many of them. But I don't want to single one particular out right now. Kathy on Facebook asks, what's your most memorable news story from the Richmond area? <laughs> you know, probably the most significant one was the Timothy Spencer story. He was the South Side Strangler in 1987. That Patsy Cornwell wrote that novel, Postmortem, based on that. Because it was the first time DNA evidence had ever been used to convict anyone of a serious crime. And it, you know... DNA has become legendary criminal justice since then. But that particular story, going through the throes of trying to find this guy, and then coming up with this uh, improbable hit on DNA and it having such significance, uh, is one that I think is one of the most important stories I've covered in, in these yay many years. But uh, those are kind of terse answers, but they're pretty much true.